This is a school TV original. So were you actually there performing or you just participated? I was I was performing with um, along with him legendary because I'm a part of his um his label which is YMCE. Okay. So I was part of the performance. I was well, the first act actually to open the show. Okay, I remember yeah. you were your man. Well, the first act. Yeah, yeah, I was the first I was the yeah. first to open the show. You was the first act? Yeah. Yeah, you was the first act. That's when everybody started coming up. I was like, Oh yeah, yeah I remember. They were like, we can't wait till most people come in here, son. But I had to open it because it was kinda of rushing, so yeah, but it took a while for like it to it really get to get to out. That shit to start. Right, that's a fact, man. How, how do you feel though when like you're you're put on the spot like spotlight like that? When you I get nervous at first. Actually, like I'll be honest, I get nervous at first. But when I'm on the stage, it's like I just have to do it, and right. that's what I did. You know. So it doesn't bother you that not that much people is in it. Nah, it doesn't bother me because I still, I still, it's still something I love to do at the end of the day. Right. You know what I'm saying? So I'll do it to the best of my ability, even though it's. If I'm by myself singing, right. you know, so. That's, I like that's cool. I actually seen somebody twerking to your shit, so you know. Yeah. Have <laughs> <laughs> well, you seen the Shaquay Quay? She was in the middle. Right, yeah, yeah. Shaquay Quay. Yeah. We gonna call Shaquay Quay for now. Yeah, but yeah, she's Shikwe. in the middle. So, um, like, when you make music, what do you want the people to get from it? I want them to get you know positive vibe from it because like the, the music you make is what people see you as, you know. So I make right. music for people to see me in a good light. You know what I'm saying? Like, right. Positive music, ladies' music, you know, anything that would keep the people want to hear more. That's what I mean. Oh, I don't want to put no negative vibe in music no more because I, I think it's too much of that already. Yeah, it's too open. So I'm yeah. trying to bring a different side and some kind of different thing to change the world. You know what right. I'm saying? Right. A different vibe. A different vibe, actually. So. Right. So how long have you been doing um, music? I've been that. I used to dance before I started singing. Oh, you was a yeah, I was a I'm still a dancer, but I just switched over now. Right, so you're more into the music aspect than dancing. Why, why the switch? Because when I was younger, I used to like freestyle in school. My friends used to beat on the desk and stuff, and I used to sing. Right. But as I, when I came up here, no, when I came up here, it was a dance group in my in my high school, mm-hmm. and I used to like since I love music so much, anything to do with music, I want to do it, dancing, anything. So I joined a dance group and I was dancing for a few hours, for a few few times and then I just just wanted to do music and I did it. Right. And I felt the calling like it was meant to be done. You know? right. So it was no real bad bad blood between the group. No, it's just no bad blood. Yeah. So the group is actually not even existing. Because since it was in Florida, when I left Florida, yeah. that's when the group broke up. Really? It was like I was keeping them together, you know. So when I left, like everything fell apart. Man, that's, that's crazy, man. Yeah, man. So, so you're a reggae artist, correct? Yes. All right, cool. And so I'm a reggae artist. And obviously, uh, the culture you was in influenced you to do reggae yeah. artists. Okay. I grew up listening to reggae music. Some rap, but not not a lot. Mostly reggae and dancehall and soca and you know, calypso and stuff like that. Um. So, what what calypso. country are you from? Saint Vincent. You're from Saint Vincent. Yeah, my country they sing calypso, calypso music. Like it's like so that's a different genre. Of yeah, it's it? like a different. It's like it's like fast. It's like close to African, but it's really like I can't explain it. It's just called calypso, my my country. Now I only ask because I had came across a Caribbean person and they broke it down to me in different ways. They say it's different. Yeah, it's different. Different, 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 styles. different styles. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's what I'm saying. So I can't really explain it from my point of view. 
Because if you're West Indian, you can, you, you know, you can tell the person from Haiti. You you can tell the person right. from Jamaica. You can tell the person from Trinidad. Right. right. You feel me? Like you can you can hear it in their dialect. Though. Right. Now now American born people may not. American people have the tendency to bind everybody up into one category. Right. You know. Right. You know right. Right. So most, most Americans only know Jamaica or yeah. Jamaica or or Trinidad or Trinidad. Haiti or something. Like, right. You don't, you don't really know the the in between countries. It's, it's, it's a big, it's a big group of islands. You know? Correct. Now, if I, if I had to guess, I, I'd have guessed that you was Trinity. That's what I was about to say. Until yeah, you I just said, true, until you said you're from Saint Vincent, I'm like, yo, your accent sounds Trinidadian. But maybe because my, my girl is Trinity. Maybe that's <laughs> what it is. Yeah, too, much <laughs> <laughs> too much curry. Yeah, too much curry. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so much curry, man. Yeah. Oh, so, so, so yeah. Uh, so um, how um, how many um, works have you completed? Like how many albums you completed thus far? I haven't you? done no albums yet because I, I started like three years ago. Just I should say three okay. years ago. Right. I have a few songs out. Like I think I have four songs out on YouTube. Okay. Yeah. Now you sent me two tracks. I now. sent you two. Yes. That's, one, that's the last two I did. All um, right. Uh, before that, I have I have three more. Have you shot any video for them? No, no, no video yet. It's coming soon though. Yeah, but so, what, his one so, thing. Because the reason I have to, why, 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 I haven't yeah. done that yet because I'm doing everything by myself. You know what I'm saying? I got yeah. paid for footage, I got paid for this, for that. So, you know what I'm saying? When I get the chance to do it, then I'll do it. Oh, well, we, we can work something out possibly after yeah. the show. Yeah. Yeah. Talk, talk, so De- definitely. Sure. Um, what you should have though, because I heard both of your tracks and they, they mean, man. You know, mm-hmm. I, I see a chick busting a mean wine in one of them songs. Oh, <laughs> man. Yo, you just see my Instagram and said, Big girl went into them songs, though. Oh, gosh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, gosh. What what was the biggest reaction you got performing one of your songs amongst a reggae, reggae atmosphere? Well, Jamaican Caribbean atmosphere. Um, well, I got a good figure. Like, the first time I performed, the mic actually wasn't working that well. Mm. So when it actually gets to working and I started performing, like the people started to feel the vibe and stuff. I only performed for like a minute or what. The time I got, I got a good reception from it. And after that, I had a, I got some a, a radio station. Um, I forgot what it's called, but they wanted me on the show. But I had to send in my song for them to put on the radio. So I actually got some airtime, some radio play for that song to perform. Oh, that's that dope. Time. Yeah. Super dope. Super dope. Super dope. Not the, um, what do you think about the whole Drake taking? Y'all culture of music and running with it and making it a bigger. What I'm making it on a bigger place. It's making it basically making it mainstream, basically. Mm-hmm. But so. the thing is, that I don't have a problem with it. But what I have a problem with is they're not giving no credit in where it's due. Cause mm-hmm. I, I hear a lot of Drake songs, a lot of not not even Drake alone, like a lot of songs, a lot of songs mm-hmm. that has back in the day reggae songs, old reggae songs that mm-hmm. nobody would ever would ever hear. Right. Until they remix it, but people from the Caribbean who know them songs, they will know. But like Americans and people like that, they won't really know because they never heard the old old reggae songs before. So that's what the the, the rap artists and most of them is using to right. men. You know what I'm saying? Like the bro, same lyrics, everything, bro. Basically for a bigger mm-hmm. audience. Basically. Yeah, they're not giving. But the thing I have a problem with is not is not giving credit where it's due. Right. That's right. it. The music, the music. I love music. You can do whatever you want with it, but. You gotta show respect at the end of the day. You know what I'm saying? Because they're the one that that influence you. So you, you gotta, you know what I'm saying? Show some respect to where you got your influence from. Right. right so what's, what, what's next on your uh, What's next on your plans? The videos, man. That, the that's videos the next thing on my plan, bro. The music is there already. I just gotta get some footage now so people can see my face and you know. You know I understand that, but you 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 not considering like dropping some sort of compilation of music like an EP or you know, yeah yeah or a mixtape. I'm, I'm, I'm working on an album right now, but I'm just currently acquiring the beats and mm-hmm. the producers and everything. Right. So the EP is gonna come soon along with the videos. Everything's gonna be at one time. Like the videos, the EPs, it's gonna drop. You know, you know. That's cool, man. So I, I don't want to say no dates yet. I just yeah. Want to, Keep it in the air, like, you know? Got you, got you. So, you, do you have the booty shakers or no? <laughs> What's that? Like, girl shaking? Yeah, yeah you better have yeah. I, 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 I have them on my Instagram. Just follow me and you'll see them. Oh, yeah, but if you follow me, I think, I think my girl has tied something to do with something. Oh, oh, man. Oh, shout out to you, girl, man. But yeah, listen, don't worry, I'm going to snipe all the biddies. Okay? <laughs> Sniping all the booty shakers. Yeah, they are there, man. <laughs> but you can follow me at um, Jacket on Instagram. Everything is Jacket. Facebook, Twitter. 
Uh, all right, SoundCloud. SoundCloud. That's good, man, because I, I, I don't I don't like when artists have one name for this and then one name for that. Like, you can't find me like that. Yeah. Facts. Everybody should be able to find you yeah, that one name. I know, I know artists that have a name for this, a name for that, a name for that. It's like, it's too much, bro. Mm-hmm. I usually do that at one point. Yeah. yeah. You got to keep one views. You got to keep one name. Right. Oh, yeah. You think that's, I think that's the most efficient way to, to promote right. yourself. I think I think I'm doing oh, it right now actually. Yeah, you are, man. You always do it. Like he got his Instagram's like easy green, but you know the threes are ease. So it's like, <laughs> <That's> I, <right. laughs> I have no choice. Yeah, I know. I understand that. People, people just be, yeah. you know, using the name. So you just yeah, yeah, there's a lot of the same similar names out there. Exactly. Yeah, so yeah. it's kind of all. Now you, you just mentioned that you know you got a girl, right? So yeah. how can you manage both of those lives with your music life? I got a girl. I had to be under something. And yeah, and and is, it, is your girl uh, the mother of the child? Mm-hmm. All right, that's good then. Mm-hmm. She, yeah, she, she's good. So how do you manage everything? Because that's that's essential for artists too. A lot of free time to work yeah, on the craft. Yeah, you got to do You know, you got to spend time with your family. You got to mm-hmm. focus on your music. But mm-hmm. like, I, I think I, I think I got it down pat because I got time for my family and I got time for my. I, I choose the right time to do whatever I can. And my son, he loves music, so I'll be home. I play instrumentals and I just write in my house while I'm with my family. We do it together as a family. Even my girl helps me sometimes. That's good. Cool. She, yeah, because she used to she used to be a she, she, could, she used to be a singer. Oh, yeah, she, wow. sing, she, 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 she have a great voice. Mm-hmm. So when you you're not gonna get on the track like you pressure her? I never did because she 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 strayed away from it because like I think somebody tried to sign her, but the contract was saying that. Like, you know, they wanted all the profits and shit like that. So, oh, yeah, it's one of those. Yeah. She, they were trying to dig it. She yeah, was so she, she, like, uh, <laughs> she does it, you know, she said, screw that. But right. she, she still got me out with some of my tracks, you know. That's dope, man. Like, I sing it to her before I even put it out. Right. Mm-hmm. So once a girl like it, I know everybody's going to like it. That's and, she, she's and she's honest. She would tell me if she don't like it, she would tell me she do. Do you have any disagreements while you're creating or no? Uh, all the time. Right. That's good. All the time. Yeah, yeah, of course. It's yeah, needed. Too. Much needed. Nah, definitely. So, you know, we're going to take a break right now. And when we bring back Jai Kid, my man Jai Kid, we're going to take him out with a performance. He's going to perform you and I. So, you know, flu take us away. That's for the ladies. I'm yeah, no, you know, I heard the song. When well, I heard the song, I was like, oh, nah. Like, oh, I could see oh, chicks in the club busting the bus nasty Yo, why bust I get videos in my DMs from girls, bro. All right. Send a good song, bro. All right, cool. Sure. Yeah. These girls. I'm saying, I'll send you upset. I would. Well, all right, man. We'll, we'll be right back, man. DJ Flu will take us away on the best show. Mm-hmm. You and I, you and I, don't need nobody else but you, my boo. You and I, you and I 